Hi there Gemini, I'm Jennifer Angel. Thanks so much for watching. This is my forecast view for the week of November the 28th. So we have a, a new moon this week. It's right opposite your sign, right in the area of your relationships. So this can be any relationships, so intimate love relationships or career relationships. So um, it's a great time for you to really start afresh with someone if you, uh, you know, have had like any um, upsets, not that Gemini really has a lot of upsets, but you know, if things need to be said, then this is a good time to say it, particularly this week as Mercury is still in this area of your chart, because right at the end of the week, it's going to move into the next sign, and that is going to be very, very good for you on a monetary level or, or support and getting news about perhaps uh, situations that you've been waiting for that are aligned to finances and uh, communications and start to come together. However, in that same area, Venus is going to square um, Uranus. So be careful who you talk to. I mean, everybody has an opinion, right? And uh, you know, it's not always the best opinion. I mean, certainly you know, listen, but you don't have, just because someone says something or their opinion uh, and, um, you know, they might think that it's the only way, well, you know what, there's generally many, many roads to Rome, as they say. Uh, so, you know, at the end of the day, it's up to you, Gemini, to make up your mind what you want to do, even if you are getting advice from professionals, okay? And at the end of the day, it's up to you to trust your instincts, trust your knowledge um, and your experience and your history, and then you make the right decision for you. Now, try not to be too hasty either. Um, we do have a couple of aspects with Mars and um, right at the end of the week, and uh, there's a, a more favorable aspect, and um, but the, we do have Mars and Saturn in a sextile. Okay, now this is an opportunity, but the opposite energies. Saturn wants to be, you know, wants to pull back and, um, you know, be a little bit more cautious, and uh, of course Mars wants to be impulsive so you want to be a little careful about just jumping the gun it's like there's a great opportunity coming through someone but you want to make sure that you're getting the best deal that you possibly can I think that's the point okay um, all right so um, happy Thanksgiving here in America and uh, happy holidays and if you're not in America you may not know that the day after Thanksgiving the Friday is called a Black Friday it's the biggest shopping day of the year and staying in line with with that I have put specials on all of my private readings right through to the end of November so you can go along to jenniferangel.com um, jenniferangelhoroscopes.com they both lead to the same place and have a look at my personal readings if you thought about having a one-on-one -on -one reading this is a great time to book it while I've got some specials on and then you can schedule it anytime all right I love doing the personal readings on the chart readings so I hope you take advantage of that um, just reach out to me on my email jennifer at jenniferangel.com if you've got any questions okay all right love and luck to you have a great week happy holidays bye